What up, y'all? Welcome back to another Vintage Cube Draft. Um, let's do the let's do the sort of step. Where we got to pick one of the first three cards, but we can sort them. But Kerwitz here, and he won't hipster time. Oh, dang it, Kerwitz here. <clears throat> I don't even know what to pick then. Well, that's the challenge. Oh Jesus! Hipster draft. God, fuck! Oh God! Oh Jesus! That's the Oracle's pretty hipster. I'll just take it. Uh, I just picked something I was afraid. I don't know what to do now. Well, we took Academy, so we could take the random. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah. Maybe no. Yeah. Yeah, I don't really know how to do a hipster step. Carl, I'm just really I don't know how to do this, man. I think that's what it is. Like I feel like I always try to do it, but then I'm like, I have no idea. Like when you say the under undiscovered cards that people don't know about yet, like, I feel like I'm just in cube. I, and I also just feel like you're just saying take bad cards that no one plays. You know what I mean? Like so I think it's just I'm just confused <laughs> what to do. Oh god. Also, Primeval Titan in here, man. Darn Dynamo it is. Oh, yeah. Is it just Blightsteel or is it Smokestack? No, not Smokestack. It's already Signet, rather. <laughs> well, Blightsteel is kind of the payout for this kind of deck. I agree. And Tinker? Mmm. Tundra. Golos. Oh, we're Golosing for sure. Golos getting this deck to you. <clears throat> Plus, he's an artifact, so that's cool. He is an artifact. Look at that. Look at all these crumbs I'm eating. They're just like literal like <clears throat> Oreo crumbs. Hmm. Well, the What's artifacts are clearly dried up. Like, because it makes an artifact? That doesn't make any yeah. sense. That doesn't do anything. You can also just take probably cream and tar pit because there's a decent chance we end up in that color as well. Are we good. Black? Yeah. Well, why is... No. No. Black's just powerful. <laughs> Black's just powerful. What am I going to take instead? Lightning Bolt. Lightning Bolt? I think there's a bigger Thank defense you. for a red-blue deck with artifacts than a black-blue deck. Argonz a. R. Gonzalez, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. All Welcome right. back. Kurt wants it anyway. Mmm. Mmm. Siggy. Got hunter down here. Ballista? Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. We're doing it. We're doing it. The only problem with this deck is like without Tinker, it loses a lot of power. Or metal worker. Yeah, that works too. <clears throat> Hot blooded, check it and see. I got a fever like Michael B. Guess we might play the thing in the ice. I will never play the thing in the ice. Ice stage, maybe. Yeah, I'll just take a light up. The thing in the ice is trash. Yeah, you're right. I've never flipped a thing in the ice, and I've never had a thing in the ice flipped against me. <clears throat> Well, this pack is poop. Maybe we end up white and blinking them. I don't know. Oh, maybe Thunderball in case we're in the bread. It's just kind of a beater. Sure, we'll just take all the red cards. Oh wow. Probably Hollowed Fountain. You should sideboard into a burn deck. <laughs> yeah, that's my uh, mono brown deck that sideboards into a burn deck. You know what I'm saying? No. You feel me, bro? Please explain. No. <coughs> oh, I hate it so much, but I think we take it. Smokestack? Yeah. I don't like it. I don't either. It's just not a fun card to play or play against. Plus, like, you have to have something to make it, like, not suck. Like a recurring sack thing. Recurring sack? <coughs> 
Like, if we had, like, a hanger back, maybe it would be good, but... Hot-blooded jacket and see. I've got a fever named Michael B. <clears throat> Look you at gotta this. be careful with that new haircut, visiting little Boofy. People might think you're in the West Side Boofy gang. <laughs> what if I already was? Oh, the WBG. Tinker! What did you... <laughs> did you just fuse? Yeah. But yeah, we are taking Tinker now. <clears throat> That's what daddy likes. Oh, man, I'm so full right now. Like, I'm disgustingly full. Yeah, it was a lot of food. Yeah, imagine I just got a burrito. Michael got a burrito and a quesadilla. So his fat level's over 9,000. I'm thinking Coalition Relic for sure. <clears throat> oh, man, Doretti's good, too. No. Nah. He's not that good. Coalition, like, we have Academy. We want that. Plus, like, Doretti will probably wheel. Yeah, one of those Doretti will likely wheel. Also, that's why you want to be red, because you have Welder, you have Doretti, like, the, there's definitely a Goblin theme. Uh, you also have Dac Faden if you get it. Welder, you have to, you still have to have, like, pieces to work, but you have to have mm. discard stuff. It's oh, fine. Well, well, he's there, so. It's fine, I'll get the pieces, Michael. What's the matter I'll with you? I'll get the pieces. The pizzas. The Reese's pieces. Michael, get the pizzas. Copter. Copter. Right. I know you like Copter, but how are we going to activate it? We have literally five creatures in the deck. <clears throat> Blight still doesn't count. I don't think we're playing Blady Boy. <clears throat> you passed copter buddy listen to me signet yeah hot blooded well see i got a fever like michael b do 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 wait clear that chocolate brown clip clear that chocolate brown clip click the chocolate brown clip i don't know if i remember this one i eat up I can't slow down. My opponent's a piece of shit. Chocolate brown. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure chocolate brown oh, is really... Oh, it's your boy. Oh, but there's workshops? I think workshops has to be the pick on this deck, right? It's one workshop. It's singular. There's not multiple workshops. Well, maybe you should buy more than one. I, I, you can't. I can't even afford one, Michael. Oh, God. Chops is so good for us. Like turn two dynamo. Turn one relic. Oh my god. <laughs> <clears throat> Just remember I love you. Just remember. He can't he can't stop himself. Uh Sphinx is kind of a good tinker target sometimes. Oh, it always cracks me up when, like, there's certain cards, and then, like, one card that's expensive will go behind it, and you're like, uh, they're like, you're never paying 12 for this. What did you say, Sphinx? Yeah. Now we're gonna cast it. It's a Tinker Target. <laughs> Actually, that's true. And we do have Coalition Relic and Hollowed Fountain so far. And Orzhov Signet, and both of our Signets make black. Yeah, we got extra cast. You know what? Them. Maybe it's fine. Oh, Inky! Oh, Inky boy! Inky McStinky! You guys are right. He was coming. Cha uh, uh, Ruins is good if we get mine, Slaver. Chalice, Chalice, I think is, Chalice just, is good. Even Chalice on zero sometimes can be good. Well, yeah, because you tinker into it. Yeah. And you can academy. Like, it's just a mox. Of Music Manly has told me he's in this draft like 14 times. I'm in the draft. I'm toy. God, I'm in the draft. Greaves. <laughs> Listen oh. to me. Haste him up. Tinker with that in play. I'm trying to help you. <laughs> oh, Emery? Yeah, okay. Emery is legit here. <clears throat> uh, take Oblivion Ringu. Oh, no. Are you okay? Do you have hiccups? I think so. Oh, Lord, are they coming? Oh, Lord, are they, they coming? We'll see. That was one. No respect. You see how late the library was that? Third to last pick. Library? Come on, guys. I don't want anyone to kill my stuff, so. <coughs> Give me that metal worker so I can take this smokestack out. Not like that's a why I would take it out, but, you know. Yeah, it still might be worth playing. <clears throat> Smoky? On top of all smoke. I think we're good. I don't think we got hiccups. 
On the down on the ocean. Which I know is unfortunate for you because <clears throat> I think it would have been hilarious. Man of Crypt. Okay. I mean, there's nothing really else in this pack. I mean, Tezzer would be sweet. <clears throat> Monk, Mike Biden made a kung fu good. noise with non kung fu movements. <clears throat> It's true. <clears throat> it light up my dances. Don't know if we're playing the red oh stuff, but you don't know if we're playing what? The red stuff. You got the red stuff, baby. Girl, you got me going on. Don't we have a blue white lane? You got the right now, baby. Michael, me, right down. How long is this going to last? It's forever. It's the new... It's probably it's, just Signet, right? It's probably just Signet. I don't care about Marsh Flats here. Teferi would have been okay, but... <clears throat> Did any of the new kids on the block ever do anything? No, other than new kids? No. I saw Austin Powers' gold member in the theater back in the day. When Fat Bastard started singing on top of spaghetti while in the toilet, I was the only person in the full theater that lulled. Oh, that's... Uh, Mind Slaver? Pretty good with Goblin Mulder. I hear that's like infinite. Twenty more cards than the minimum deck size, so sixty cards. You have to play sixty card deck. Can we do it? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Unless you want an O three. Well, Nick's stipulation was Yorin has to be your companion. So. I don't know, man. Well, let's see what it looks like. Put a bunch of cards in. I don't know if we have time to do that. I might just take it and play it as is. Over Mind Slaver? I don't care about Mind Slaver, really. Now look, we get a Teferi? That's, That's a good Teferi. <clears throat> Mind Slaver is pretty good in your Goblin Welder deck. Time Warp? Could also be Plateau. If you want to play the red, yeah. But you passed the Mind Slaver, so I don't think we need to be red anymore. Wait, why don't but we... But we also need to be white. Wait, no. why would we? Why would the red be for Mind Slaver? Because, like, well, there's not really that great in this deck right now. Really? You can't, like, discard an Inkle Leviathan and switch it out for a Rakdos Signet? That seems pretty good. How are you discarding it? I mean, you don't have to discard it, but, like, you can Emery it into the graveyard. And that's pretty much it, man. <laughs> what, else, what else do you need? <clears throat> uh-huh. You light up my Days, get senses em. like a night in a forest. Is Scarabat just better? Why do they even bother with Maze of Ith and Cubes and Titan and freaking Ultra? Yeah, I don't know why Maze of Ith isn't this anymore. It's not powerful enough. I hate Maze of Ith. Maze of Ith. Maze of Ith. <clears throat> I think it's Scarabat here. It's your battle, boy! Yeah, sure. I wish we had a metal worker, but what can you do? That's pretty good smoke Wow, that's a late control magic. I'll take it. Ooh, Tezzeret. Oh, that's okay. What? Okay. Sure, <clears throat> dude. Easy game, easy life. <coughs> easy game, easy life. This Eorion's a companion. Now just pull Egypt's Landing. Egypt's Landing? Egypt's Landing. Egypt's Landing? Oh, Mind Sliver came back? <laughs> well, so much for that pick. <clears throat> Makes it easy. I am the Eggman. <laughs> Michael is the Eggman. Mike B, what is your favorite non-basic land in Magic? Preferably one with non-mana abilities. With non-mana abilities? Um, you light up my senses like a chicken in a field. All right, so we're everything but green here, right? No, I know, like, I'm just trying to think of something. <clears throat> this is 32. Well, crypt and everything else counts. That's not, those are lands. Could play Lotus Bloom. 
Ugh. I play Legion's Landing. That seems even worse than the lowest one. So we're trying to get to... Maybe Terminus? <clears throat> Terminus is actually Terminus is fine, fun. yeah. Well, we're going to have like 24 lands. So I'm going to get an ice cream sandwich. Oh, wait. What happens? So we need three more playables? I think it's just blue, maybe. Yeah. This might not be worth it. Yeah, I'd rather have a deck that's good. Oh, but you want to try to complete the stip, then go for it. I don't think it's worth it for this deck. We can just play Legion's Landing. It's fine. Just a chump blocker. That seems terrible. Yeah, what if you flip it? <coughs> uh. <laughs> what if you flip it? Yeah, Think but what other it. deck are you going to have to play Urion with, right? I don't know. Academy Ruins. What are you guys saying right now? Are we talking about lands? We don't have Academy Ruins. No, nah, I'm reading the chat. You should know. You read the chat constantly. No, I know. I'm just saying someone no. says Academy Ruins is sweet. We don't have it. They're referring, yeah, and then I figured out why would they say that. So then I read more oh. into the context. I'm just going to strip mine, guys. I'm that guy. This is 27 cards. I think we just cut the red. I agree. I don't think these are exciting. It's good with Mind Slaver, but this also makes our mana bad, so. So we need you light up at least my one more cut. Sales, like Michael in the trash can. Core? I don't think we need Ludo Core. <coughs> really? It's a decent filter and also lets you discard so that you can <clears throat> Goblin Welder. <laughs> well, you gotta choose. Are we playing red or not? No. Scarab God seems kind of loose. Really? I have no fixing for it. We literally have Golos, Rakdos, Signet, and Orzov, Signet, and Coalition Relic. Okay, never mind. And Tezzeret can search out three of those. So is that one, two, three, four, five? I get it. Six sources if we add one swamp? I don't know. Seems reasonable. Do we need Lightning Greaves? Is that overkill? I mean, it's nice to attack with, like, Inqu... Now you can't even equip that dude. Blight Let's steel. go with white steel, but it's kind of, I think it's too cute. Let's just play forty one. Done. What about oblivion ring? Do we need oblivion ring? We could probably cut that. I mean, it's removal. We're a little light on that, but I don't think this is a deck that gives a shit about removal. No, we just crush them. Get rid of this. Actually, maybe scarabout is too cute. I mean, Urberg technically doesn't produce mana, but it does. So I don't know if it really counts. Yes, it does. Urborg literally is a swamp. <clears throat> it produces mana the same way a swamp does. Right, but we were trying to name things that are like, do stuff that isn't normal. Like, doesn't just produce mana. Tell them something from 15, 16, 17. Yeah, that seems fine with me. Yeah, I like it. Hmm. Hit the I. <laughs> it's a with P, an Michael. It's an F. Looks like an F to me from here. That's a little excessive. No. <laughs> Castle Gatternbrick has delicious glass pies. <clears throat> Man, I can't wait to see how fat I am tomorrow. Did you say you can't wait to see how fat you are tomorrow? Yeah. Oh, because you bought a scale. A scale, yeah. <clears throat> have you been to the Castle Garen Brig? They have delicious glass pies, dude. Do you need a basic swamp? I don't think it hurts us that much. We have plenty of blue sources. Plus, we have a. No, goals. we don't have one. I took it out. Oh, you did? Yeah. Hmm. I think I should have. Well, we have Golos. You might want it. Wait, for what though? Why do I want the swamp? I don't understand. For Scarab God? We took it out. Oh, you did? Yeah, Scarab God's right here. Oh. Well, I hope you took it. <gasps> swamp. Are you okay, man? Yes, I got a door. The hiccups are coming. You got a door? Did Mike wear the shirt yet? No, I've not worn the shirt yet. It's over there. Ooh. Oh, Jimmy. <clears throat> Jimmy Lum. I gotta take it in my room so I can remember to wear it. 
Yeah, I knew they put a swamp in there because we uh, have a Sphinx of the Steel in, but I didn't think they actually... I thought I took it out. Maybe I'm mistaken. It might be... Well, no, we have still plenty of black. We don't need it, I guess. Plus, you're, like, hard... You're not... You're really, I don't think you're often going to be casting Sphinx of the Steel in, so... We should dress a Time Walk Thousand Year Storm deck and see how many tries we can take in a row. Yeah, you make it sound like you could just draft whatever color you want. You're like, hey, man, I want to draft Ancestral Recall, so I'm going to do that. But I also want Thousand Year Storm. Is that unreasonable? Like I said, MDG Pyro, thank you for the resub, buddy. What a great day it is. My sub anniversary, Mike B's birthday, and Mike is bald. <laughs> There's a lot going on. Oh, goodness gracious. The Mustang Sally. Mustang I can feel like you can get a thousand your store whenever you want. Is that the same? That doesn't feel the same at all. What'd they hit? Oh, cryptic command. Wonderful. Wonderful. So I kind of want to just play Teferi here. Big Tefs. Spending cheese. <laughs> so they have no pressure and this just turns off their cryptic command so they have to like bounce it with cryptic command that's cool I'll replay I'm using text to speech because I'm trying to eat ice cream sandwich it's doing stupid stuff <laughs> oh that's pretty good <coughs> I might have to restart MTGO hold on let's see what's going on here just doing that oh glitch. yeah, it's well, it's not a glitch. It's just like sucking up memory. Yeah, it's got a memory leak. Problem. A meg 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 memory leak. That's <laughs> been happening for like two years, if not longer. Since 1924. See, that's what you need the Rise of Nine for. Is my MTGO memory leak? I have a Rise of Nine. Yeah. It doesn't. That's not. That's not the right. It's pattern. a joke. Okay. God. You think your jokes are funny, Michael? Sometimes. Name one joke you've told that was funny. Bitch, please. The amount of comedy I produce on this stream, incalculable. Incalculable. Yeah. You see my egghead? It's beautiful. It was all for the stream. I thought it was for the nookie. <laughs> so you can take that cookie. <clears throat> Stick it in your wookie. Stick it in your Wookie. So you could take that cookie and stick it in your Wookie. So we can go one, two, three, four, Thran Dynamo, Talarian Academy, and then cast. I'm like a bee. So now we can actually cast a Thran. We can cast. Let's cast Time Warp on their turn. So they're probably going to negative six on our O Resolve Signato. Sin oh, they didn't. Fascinating. It's really incalculable. It's really incalculable. <laughs> Oh, look at this Teferi. Oh, that's interesting. Let's play another one of these guys. Three, four. Dynamo. Plus Tarifi. Play a Relic. Let's 
Yeah, we can get that swamp now. Can we activate Golos someday? Someday. Thank you. Out there. Beneath the Michael Bees. I'm something like Michael B. Living up in the trees. Do, 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 do. That's a song I just wrote. All right, who are we killing? Who's good? We're killing Teferi. <laughs> Narsetto. Let's kill Narset. <clears throat> and. We're Oblivion Ring Nahiri. Hmm. What are we bouncing here? Probably Golos? What about Alt? What? What about Alt? What about Alt? Nahiri's Alt. Yeah, we're Oblivion Ring that. Okay. You also can't bounce Planeswalkers. Not with that attitude. Or any attitude whatsoever. Yeah, see? Typical attitude. Four, five, six, seven, five, six. Yeah, this is fine. Should we got greedy and played one of the other Thank color you. lands to get the goal of Probably. <clears throat> Arctic Avenger with the gifted sub. Bobby Biscuits, thank you so much for the sub, buddy. Really appreciate it. Who let the bot sub expire? My dad. Mike's dad. Alright, so we got one, two, three, four. Play Oblivion Ring. Let's get rid of Nahiri for your for your bullshit. Play this guy. And then we'll just coalition relic, and you can't really do anything about it. Oh, we have to get rid of Teferi next turn though, otherwise we can't cast the Golos. Yes we can. Cause you're just casting like normal. hey we can actually activate goals with coalition relic i know coalition okay. relic is op it's very good sure more like shit drifter oh shit drifter, drifter. i believe you can walk me. into the shit wow <clears throat> We're going to add a green. Oh, wow. That's a lot of mana. Holy buzgolies. <laughs> Holy buzgolies. <laughs> I mean, I wonder if it's even worth activating goals so we can just jam that guy for a million. Okay. Uh, can, 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 the, these don't go in the stack. They're just exiling three cards and you're just paying them like normal. Yeah, you're still playing sorcery speed. But isn't Bliss just better, though? Three, four, five. Then activating Golos? Yeah. Three, four, five. Or you can Bliss for like a million, right? I mean, we could probably still do that, right? Like one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we'll have one left over. Two, three, four. And my hit artifacts. Five, yeah, you're right. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Like we can still ballista for five, but I'd rather just activate Golos right now. Because what if we hit like Inkwell? Consecrated Sphinx and Sphinx. The Sphinx boys are at it again. We didn't add a man off that. Because of Sphinx of the Steel Wing. Why is it five? Okay. Okay, done. Not like you can't overpay. Yeah, this is pretty silly. I mean, short of Wrath, and even if they do Wrath, we got that to back it up. Yeah, this deck is doing some sweet shit. Yeah, this deck's kind of broken. Wait, why shouldn't it work? Like, mm -hmm. I mean, there's no reason it should work. They're, they're, like, the stack is clear. You're casting a spell with Golos. Yeah, you don't cast them at instant speed, you cast them at sorcery. There's nothing on the stack. That's why you can't activate goals on a person's turn unless you get lucky and hit an instance off of them. Get in the car, loser. We're going to Sphinx Town. 
This baby can fit so many sphinxes in it. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> oh god yeah that was good man I got a good meme library I don't think we need this idiot but they have a lot of they have a lot of uh I don't want to lose any babies <laughs> they don't have any they have a lot of planeswalkers I kind of want this lightning bolt but I don't think we're gonna at that point you might as well put in boulder too Mother too? Mother too? Well, there too. Did you say mother? He said mother, didn't he? I think maybe shrine. Flip it. I would put shrine in there. Just this is a slow Bernie boy. I think our deck's fine. I, don't change I agree. I'll even keep the black in. You know, I've been listening to a lot of lately. No. Kid Cuddy. Oh, give me his hands awkward. It's it awkward. Well, it's not that awkward though. Yeah, but as it it's tinker with no tinker targets. You mean? And our best one in our hand. Yeah, but we still have Mere Battle Sphere and Sphinx of the Steel. Shut up and take my money. One Golos activation buck. Golos is Superfoot's favorite card since Fire has been banned. Golos is so sick. I'm thinking about taking my. Switching my. um. Taking my, switching my, taking my switch. Switching my, taking my, taking <laughs> oh my, my switch. Oh my god. I hate you! Uh, I'm thinking about I'm thinking taking about my. Uh, thinking about it. What's that guy's name? Golos is his name. We just talked no, about it. No, not Golos. Um, thinking about taking my thing, singing them up. This is sad. Ba, 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 my ba, ba, main ba. commander deck, I can't think of the name of my commander. Is it Nicol Bolas? No. Is it Arcade's Sabbath? No. Is it. It's the guy that you play free stuff for Wooberg. Oh, Charles. No. War no. Okay. no. <laughs> nope. Billiam Sonoma. Yeah, you know, just cast it for zero. Tinker. They're gonna be like Jota. Oh, that's you it. Yes. The wrong way, I'm thinking stupid. about swapping out Jota for um, Golos and making that my commander. Jota's like better at doing is better for the deck, but I think Golos is more fun. I got a big fat shark right here. It's, I don't think it's, it's like it's a, a big old shark. It's, 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 you know what it actually is? It's literally a Leviathan. Is it pickleballus, Michael? Oh, that's my favorite. Pickleballus. You ever like when there's a hole in your shirt so you can do this? I don't know what you're doing, man. It looks it looks intimate though. <laughs> Who can turn the world on with their smile? So if you're gonna blow up the world anyway, I'm just gonna attack your face because I don't care about Tarifi. Now he goes too, right? Unless he puts a counter on. Yeah, but then like you're gonna be in, then you're gonna be in a world of pain because I'm gonna time warp and kill you. What if he's greedy and gives us another turn? So what if he doesn't have fifth land? Him? And then we attack, time warp, attack. Is like, it Victus as Monty Michael? Is that who is that who your deck is about? No, you know no. Victus, Michael? No. Michael, you know Victus? No. They're dead. No, they're dead. They're actual dead. Yeah. You got greedy. They might not have a land. They don't have fair. a land. They would. There's no way they would have played this instead of a land. Oh, they Unless do they, they are greedy. They think they're not dead, but they're dead. Hope you got a counter spell, bro. I hope you don't. Not you dead. Why wouldn't you blow up the world when having Cole Leviathan? <laughs> Come on, buddy. Come on. You saw Time Warp in the first match. You know I got it. Shoot. I guess I could just get this whole fixed and the shirt would be fine. Or you can just buy a new shirt because you I can afford it. Shirt. Yeah, you're right. I have no excuse. <laughs> Michael's like, I'm going to get this t-shirt fixed. <laughs> That's like... <laughs> it's like the poorest thing It's fine. Thing I'm slowly mailing Mike a new wardrobe. He's right. Jesus. It's also funny because Mike has to get out of these fucking poor people habits where he's like, man, I bet I can get this hole in my shirt fixed. Well, I've been poor for a long time, friend. <laughs> I know. So it's going to take a while to be like, wait, I could just buy a new t-shirt. They sell those at stores that are available to me. Snap it and keep it. Mike B, I had shirts with holes in them when I was a kid. I also had pants with holes in the pockets as well, as I had no toys and wanted to play with something. God, it's getting real sad up in here. 
God, tell the stream your best poverty stories, guys. Oh, wow. Got a load of fucking show off McGee over here. Maybe it's me who's the show off McGee. Do I get to, do I hollowed fountain and steal this? And just oblivion ring it? Because we can also Tefri bounce our own oblivion ring. Oh, that is pretty good. Next turn, yeah. Yeah, so that it doesn't really matter. But it keeps them off whatever mana they have next turn. Who can turn the world? Are you going to counter my obli Oh, okay. <laughs> it's like, what? Making garlic bread with butter, oregano, and wonder bread. You know what? That The wonder bread is irrelevant, dude. That's... It's still going to be delicious. I mean, as long as it's crispy and delicious, I don't really care if it's Wonder Bread. Oh, that's one of the poor stories, I think. Oh. I, see, I couldn't even tell Actually, because I was like, that no, sounds like good. like Wonder Bread's still a name brand, so you can get cheap bread than that. I'm not saying it's high quality, but... I think Wonder Brand is like... Wonder Bread's like the cheapo of this stuff. Though. I don't know, man. What do I look like, Michael? Some kind of gigologist? Gigologist? Yeah. His garlic bread has neither salt nor garlic. Tells nor fails. Tails failed. Oh, butter and oregano. Oh, there's no. I didn't. I missed that part. Oh, I I missed that part. We can also just bounce our own mana crypt. Oh wow. Okay, I believe you. Jokes on you. I was gonna give you back your mocks. Oh geez, I made some pizza pants where I cut out <laughs> the pockets and lined them with grocery store bags, and me and my roommate would go to CC's Pizza and line the pockets with pizza to take back home. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> That's a Justin Hyde thing, man. Oh, wow. There's a Justin Hyde was on board. just weird. Wow. CC's, no less. You're you're getting CC's to go. That's rough times. That's man. wild, man. That's like my peanut butter and jelly taco. Michael, what do you think? Name it. Heads. Shut up and take my money. Good for you, buddy. Nailed it. When I was a kid, I didn't have a buck. Now I have this buck. Now you have this buck. Buck, buck, buck. <laughs> God, you really... Buck, buck, buck. <laughs> I feel like you really got me there. Every time. Revelario. Revelario. Is we answer this? This. This. Oh, this. Oh, this. Oh, this. Or one, two, three, four, five. Oh, brutal. A septic tank freezing. Couldn't afford to get it fixed. Uh, somehow, so having to ration all water to not have it overflow before summer. Yikes. That sounds terrible. My mom was a kindergarten teacher, and one day in the summer, we borrowed the pennies that the kids would use to count to buy food at the dollar store. Got dirty looks from the cashier for bringing in $6 of pennies. Michael, call it. Heads. This is my lucky charm. Just stay consistent. It's my lucky. One, two, three, four, five. We can actually just play Mirror Battle Sphere here. You like that? Love. And we get to draw a card from it? One time my butler couldn't wash my favorite pants before school, so I had to wear my second favorite <laughs> pants. And they didn't match the shoes at all. Wow. Wait, how much? Hold on. Can we just play Sphinx of the Steel in here? Is that better? I made a chicken sandwich on Eggo waffles because I was out of bread, but honestly, I would do that again. It was delicious. Yeah, that sounds amazing. I don't know. There's no, there's no downside to that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We can just play this guy next turn naturally. Like he was born for it. Who can turn the world on with Mike's face? That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Who can do that, though, you know? So next time we just follow up with Battle Sphere? This is wild, man. No black. Oh, wait, that's a swamp. I'm the fool. <laughs> Chat poll time. Better Keanu Reeves movie. The Replacements or Chain Reaction? I've never seen either of those movies. Here comes Treachery. Turnabout. What are you saying? You don't like John Wick? What, it's you don't like fun? Now. I don't like John Wick because there's too much action. Oh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Yep. Oh, that's rude. I didn't like anything that happened. Yeah, things are going awry. Like the bread. Tinker. Golos. Oh, let's have the obvious better movies. Okay. 
Best movie, Hobo with a Shotgun. Oh, boy. I have never seen nor heard of Hobo with a Shotgun. It's, uh... It's something all right. It's not a good movie. It's like a movie you watch because it's so bad. It's What's good. your favorite Keanu Reeves movie? Favorite Keanu Reeves movie? Yeah. Hit it. It's either... It might actually just be John Wick, like the original. Either that or the original Matrix. I really like the original Matrix. What about you? Mm. He actually has a surprising number of like enjoyable movies. Oh, he's great. He's a great, great number of films. I love Point Break. Point Break, solid. God, John Wick's really good, but I feel like one of my favorites has got to be from like the old, older Keanu. No, Reeves. don't don't fall for that trap, man. If if you like it, you like it. You know. Let me ask you something, man. Okay. Who can turn the world on with her smile? I haven't watched all of Hobo with a Shotgun. I watched some of it because it was... I wasn't watching it with friends or anything, so I didn't get the most enjoyment out of it. Hobo with a Shotgun! Fire away! You know that song? Do you know it? Devil's Advocate? Have De- I seen that movie? With Al Pacino? Oh, yes, I have seen that movie. Charlize Theron? Michael, name it. Heads? God, you fucked up, Michael. I didn't name it. You named it. You named you fucked it. up. I didn't name shit. You named it, Michael. See, if I would have said heads, it wouldn't have, it wouldn't have happened. But you said heads. Michael, so. you named it. I literally didn't name it. You didn't ask Michael me. Michael gave it a name, and then he walked away. Let's hit Elspeth in her face. I'm gonna tap two of these biscuity boys. I guess, you know a movie gets a lot of hate that I actually kind of like? Constantine. Oh, God. I'm burping. This guy just eats Planeswalkers for breakfast. I think they're just trying to kill us with our own mana crypt, which they could have two turns, but... I'm going to look up Keanu Reeves's... Filmography? (laughs) Well, discography, but sure. Is it filmography? Yeah, discography is for... Music? music. Yeah. God damn. Man. I was right and you were wrong. What does the world come I, to? I conceded to it. I was like, I think you're right. I think you got something Man, here. Look at that picture. So handsome. <sighs> Could be taken 30 years from now. Could be taken yesterday. Nobody Could have been taken 100 years ago because he's immortal. Oh, Everybody yeah. Remember that. his vampire roots? Yeah. Canary filmography has its own entry. Oh, my God. Oh, it's a lot. Oh, God. It's, it's more than I thought. God, it just kept going. It's like one per year. Sometimes more than one per year. Sometimes two per year. Keanu has a lot of great films, but he's never a great actor in any of them. Oh, you're insane. Yeah, I think Keanu Reeves is an incredibly underrated actor. I do think we're dying to our mana crypt here. Attack to flurry time, rebel hair. I wish I had a red, green, and land about do Guys, just chomping down on planeswalkers. Yeah, we just have to. My own private Idaho. I do not know that one. When's his first film? Probably some bullshit in the 80s. One Step Away. It was a short film. His first real movie was Young Blood. Okay. Um. Point Break was 91 when I was born. God damn. Well, they're putting us on they're they're putting us on Mana Crypt. Name it, Michael. Heads. You stupid idiot. You unbelievable <laughs> idiot. You messed up the flow, man. You 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 didn't let me get that one. You didn't let me you get that one. All. You didn't let me get that one. That one. That one. You didn't let me get that one. Maybe we just play Yorgan as a 4 5 flyer. Can blink all of us. Probably better than Tezzeret, right? Tezzeret doesn't really excite me much. That don't impress me much. Huh, huh. Raising your. No, that. <laughs> okay, you're trolling. Never mind. 
Like, what film would you consider him a bad actor in? Yeah, the problem is Keanu Reeves has his reputation of being like this, whoa, surfer guy. But then, like... But that's like his old movies where he was... Yeah, like, I think that was like when he was just younger. I don't think he does... I don't think that's his thing anymore. Like, they put him in this Bill and Ted sh uh, shell. You put him in this Bill and Ted shit! Even though, that, even though that movie is hilarious. Bill and Ted's a classic. I definitely enjoyed Speed a lot when I was younger. Speed is good. I haven't seen it in a while, but... He has the worst accents in the world in his movies. Again, you're, you're you're basing that off his old stuff. Like, in his recent films, he just talks like himself. Another day like older. The, whoa, like he doesn't, he hasn't done that in like fucking 20 years, man. Ooh, a chalice is, the chalice is so nice, you get to. Didn't see Crazy Rich Asians. What? That doesn't. Oh, September 1st. Video on demand. The new Bill and Ted. I did not know that. I really want to see that Samurai movie you did somewhere recently. I never got around to it. I can't remember the name of it. It doesn't even say he's in Crazy Rich Asians. What are you guys talking about? Hmm. <clears throat> 47 Ron, yes, that's the one. I have not seen it. Wasn't that Crazy Rich yet? No, dude, like... <laughs> What are you talking about? He probably the same way with Matthew McConaughey. They look at him as this doofy blonde dude, but his recent work is really impressive. Yeah. Same. I agree. I, yeah. Matthew McConaughey gets that reputation. He's like, oh, you know, I can't do a voice of Matthew McConaughey, but like, they just all give, right, all right. Yeah. All they just right. give him that, that meme. But like, if you watch any of his like more serious recent films, like he's an amazing actor. What are you doing here? I feel like we're just playing Teferi. Oh, yeah, that seems fine, I guess. Look at the top three cards of your library. So Jada, I agree with you. I think Nick Cage has a surprising amount of classics. Slaving pandas, you get a paycheck. I'm an actor. Um, the thing is, just because Nicolas Cage takes really, hold on. Um, just because Nicolas Cage takes like a ton of movies, doesn't mean that like he's not a good actor. You know what I mean? Like, I think we just bounce this. He wasn't the boogeyman. He was the one you sent to fucking kill the boogeyman. <laughs> That's true. We're close enough to what the quote is. I'm sure I messed it up somehow. I'm convinced Nick Cage picks scripts randomly out of a hat. Well, I know Nicholas Cage collects a comic. I would. I don't know if he collects comics plural. I've only seen the one comic that he collected. Didn't he buy the action, first like Superman? Action Comics number one. Yeah. yeah. He's known for that. He's known for it. I think he just likes collect expensive shit, which, you know. What else are you going to do with millions of dollars? More power to him, you know. Can't take it with you. What if you could, though? What if you could take it with you? No, I don't know how that works, so. Well, you can ask Jimbo the sarcophagus, Michael, because a lot of times you put your stuff in your sarcophagus. So Jimbo would know all about that. He just knows how to make him, man. That doesn't mean he, he he knows the afterlife. He knows how to what? He knows how to make him. 
He makes sarcophaguses? Yes, because he is one. This, so was, he knows not, how to make this them. was not what I was expecting from Jimbo. Well, he's a man of many talents. Well, a thing of many talents. Not really a man. Wow, know. this is now it's getting worse. <laughs> he's a thing of many talents. Now you're just being insulting. Another day older and deeper in debt. Oh, the rock? Yeah, that's a good one. That's the only good James, or not James Cameron, but uh. Oh Jesus, my opponent's going ham right now, and I don't like it. What's his name? The oh, guy that Christ. made Transformers. Are we just dead here? Probably. Oh, oh. We go to eight cards. It's not looking good. That's not great. Can we still win? Jesus. We can certainly try. Michael Bay, yeah. It's the only good Michael Bay movie. How do we get that thing into play? Michael Bay is not to be confused with Michael B. Wow. <laughs> so they hit Mirror Battlesphere, Consecrated Sphinx, and Inqua Leviathan. So there's still a Sphinx of the Steel Wind in our deck somewhere. They have one card in hand. And they're trying to replace it with something better. When does the magic movie come out? I don't even know what that is. Is that a thing? Wow, someone sent me I'm literally playing Mike B on Arena. <laughs> Someone on Arena's name is Mike B. Oh, they're going to draw whatever they want. Lion's Eye. I don't get it. Who's that last card? Jug Moss Will? <laughs> Better be. They disc past him, flames. That would be weird when they only have through the breach and... Yeah, I don't know. I have no idea. Treasure Cruise. Oh, you're going to you get crack Lion's Eye in response? Sure. That's actually fine. So we know you have one... No, we don't have Boulder in the deck. Huh. We don't have what? Boulder. No, that'd be sick. I mean, if they play any creature, we just get to control magic it. What is that quote from? I hope they just play a real... Oh, interesting. I think it's these two. Because Blight still gets shuffled back in. We didn't lose Tinker yet, so it's actually... It's from the rock. Tinker, Tinker. That ain't a Tinker. More like Stinker. Do I just time warp here? Draw a card. Also, let's draw another card if you bounce them. It's true. Like we have six cards left. We have to hope one of the the we have to hope the tinker is faster than the. One two three four five one two. I think we're fine. We just pass here. Because if they play a thing, we can also go time warp end of their turn and then control magic their guy and then attack with it on our turn, which is pretty sweet. So don't have a little, don't have a, just don't have an Elspeth. Just play a creature. Uh, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Another day older and deeper in debt. Yeah, that's fair. No, Doldrowsi doesn't mill you at Exiles, so it doesn't 
it doesn't go back in your deck. All right. Well, I was hoping it was not that. All right, one time, Tinker, not Blightsteel. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh my god, we're one man away from that. It's mm. really unfortunate. Yeah, we will not have enough to deal them enough damage. So we have four cards left. One is a Blight, so we go to three cards, attack for six. Two cards, attack for six. One card, attack for... Fuck, that's super annoying. That would probably... Yeah. Oh, look, they tapped our black down, too. Tinker. Blight Steel. Classic. Oh, yeah, we're just dead. Yeah. That's cool. So our deck is Tinker and two other cards. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we get one. Cool. <sighs> Little Mog is a cool card. keep this perfect tinker hand kind of maybe I mean obviously tinker and mana crypt would be better but you know ever flunk chalice still good gotta get my kid to brush his teeth into bed placid laughter I'll see you on the YouTube buddy thank you for hanging out I appreciate you my dude Thank you. Out there beneath the Michael Bees. I'm something like Michael B. <laughs> Living up in the trees. Do, 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 do. That was a good song. Someday. Thank you. I can't imagine that song being any better than it was there. So. Wow. Arctic Avenger gifted us those 30 minutes ago. Dang it. I just want to make sure I didn't miss it. Miss it. Miss it. Are you okay? Miss it. Are you? Kind of... Miss it. Please, someone make him stop. Miss it. Sometimes, uh, his, sometimes his stroke gets the best of him. Stroking. Did they not? Oh, they put out. Sure. Sure, 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 sure. Sure, sure, sure. sure. I stroke it to, to the, the left. <laughs> I stroke it to the right. Go on. I don't remember the rest. I think I remand this. Brainstorm it. Maybe if you stroke less, you can remember more. <laughs> God damn. Got him. Damn near killed him. God damn. What are you gonna do about Teferi? Next time we get a Golos? Mike B. Fact 63. He shaved his head today. Stay tuned for more true facts. <laughs> well, I shaved it the day before, so. That wasn't even a true fact. That was a lie. It was a lie. Did Michael B. get the brain damage from the stroking? <laughs> it's very possible, buddy. It's very possible. To this day, no one knows the true source of Michael B.'s brain damage. It's never been. Been Wait, is that your real head? No, it's a prosthetic. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
grandma doesn't even know her own grandson's head. Oh, good gravy, man. No, I went real high end prosthetic. Michael, is that your real head? Well, Junior, I need my pills. Wow. <laughs> Oh, Goodbye. Grandma. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, it seems like you snap off the Academy here. Does it? I mean, it taps for two. It does it? Uh-huh. Does it? I mean, what would you rather oh, get? Oh, Michael Biscuit. It's going to bounce this stupid thing. Oh, Tesorino. Ain't no wig man. Wig man? That's good. Goddamn make, walrus. Make fun of the burps I've been burping. What is this they're casting? Oh, oh shoops. I know he cares about Annoying, that. but. Yeah. Buddy, I got a mere battle sphere. Oh, boy. That's pretty good. So, what is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? Yeah, boy. Or, <laughs> or it gets even better. Oh, you're going to play Tetherit? Yeah. Oh, this is gross. Four. This is what? Five, six, seven mana? So we can go Tezzeret. Untap these two. Uh, yeah. And that's two, three, four, five mana. I don't think there's anything I want to search, but also this makes everything five fives next turn. Uh-huh. Oh, <laughs> that's all we need. Ooh wee, butter my biscuits. I'm gonna actually take a snap of this deck. I should have done that before, but I'd like to know my options for things, like Tezzerini. Tezzerini. You're gonna do that. He make it a spaghetti. Jesus, I'm like, when does this curve end? Oh, 11, 12, got it. He makes what? The spaghetti. Tezzerini makes the spaghetti. Yeah. I feel like we might want to bring in Disenchant, actually. Look at that. Look at how long that is. That deck's a long boy. Good thing you got a wide angle thing. Monitor. Monitor. Yeah, I know that's not the right term. <laughs> Whatever. No, man. You nailed it. That's a darn good turn. How much mana was that like? We played seven mana Battle Sphere, five mana Tezzeret. And then I think we still had five left over, so like 17 mana. This hand seems bad. Agreed. This hand seems better. Probably get rid of Tez. Emery could be decent. Okay, I would just get rid of Island. Yeah, but if we don't draw another artifact, we can't cast Emery for three. This but we'll probably true. draw it. Dude, I trust it. I bet. I'm betting. Gambler don't even know what's up. Oh shit, what are they doing? Brainstorming. You can brainstorm on turn one. Oh shit, they don't probe me. It's messed up. They're gonna be like, look at this idiot's hand. His hand seems fine. Let's draw mana, mana crypt. Oh, uh, that's. Uh, could be good. Is it gonna be good, huh? Now let's draw a mana crypt. Oh my god, mana crypt on turn two into friggin' Blightsteel Colossisos? Or. Colossisos. Or do you just get Inkwell? Uh, what colors are they? Do we know yet? What game is this? Am I alive? <laughs> my fucking What year is it? <laughs> Where's my grandma? Got any ham mana sandwiches? Crypt, mana crypt, mana crypt, mana crypt. Thran Dynamo is not a mana crypt. Not a mana crypt. I can ride my bike with my mana crypt. With my mana crypt. You know yeah, that's the, Yeah, that's the only song that anyone knows by that band. I don't even know who that band is. Uh, it's, it's No Handlebars by The Flow. What's their name? The Flow. No, oh, that's unfortunate. See, this is why I wanted to keep the island. The flow Stupid, something? The flow bots, that's it. That is the flow bots. They also have a song about um Handlebars? The Lord of the Sea. It's pretty good. I forget his name. Poseidon. That's the one. Triton? Kraken? What's Kraken lacking? What's all that chocolate on your lips? That's doo doo, <laughs> baby. They might be missing more colors, too. What did we hit? Literal nothing? Four lands? Seems Sick. good. Sick. Seems. Seems good. Couldn't even get a signet, huh? Would have been too much to ask for there. 
I think they might just have mana issues as well. Oh, we're so good at the game! One, two, three, four. Thranny Biscuits. Three. Four, five. Tezzy Biscuits. Untap. Michael, are you watching the, the game? It's all happening. Tinker Biscuits. Uh, let's get... Bite Steel, they only have blue. Ink, inkwell. Oh, wow. Mana Crypt. Cast the Mana Crypt. And let's... Your turn. <laughs> I can ride my mind. Oh, yeah, I've heard it rise. That's a good one. That's a good one. If they only have blue, like, they could bounce the Blightsteel. That's the problem. Like, there's a couple of cards that bounce the blight Blightsteel, but nothing can deal with this. Like, they don't have anything in their deck. Mono blue can't deal with an Inkwell. I can take apart the remote control and almost put it back together. Oh, God. Are they just going to... Are they storming us? What is happening right now? Nine? Nine! Nine, 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 I mean, nine. they have Probe and... What is this we're watching? Okay. Uh, is that infinite? Might be infinite. Yeah, but they still have to have something. That's the problem with Palancron. I'm like, you can make infinite mana, but I don't well, know. Actually, is that enough? They have six. So they've netted two. They yes, they make four. four. They have four to return. The cycle costs 11. Seven and four. They net 11. They make 12. So they net one every time. It's extremely slow. Are you okay? The cycle costs 11. Four to return it. Seven to cast it. They are making 12 mana. Therefore, they yeah, net right. one mana every turn. Yeah, I don't know. I'm like, what is there to think about here? Well, anyone going to go get a snack? I mean, they also only have blue mana, so like... I mean, I guess they could infinite and then time. Just going to brain freeze us and we're going to die. Yeah, that's probably that. That could happen. Stroke of genius. No, we're not going to die because we have a we have a blight steel colossus in our deck. Oh, sick! So we go to our turn, we draw blight steel, and then what? We can emery anything out of our yard. We can activate Tez, make all our guys five fives. I don't know if that does anything. We might not. We might might be dead, but we'll see. I can bring my mic with no handy bars. Well, then we just need to attack with. Inkwell, next turn activate Tezzeret and kill them. If they brain freeze us, we might not have a next turn. We get one card. Oh, shit. <laughs> Do we have a way to discard it? I was hoping we would. I don't know if this is going to be educational, Frank. I don't like being taught stuff. I'm so sorry, I'm TGDH. That's Mike, you kind of look like Bam Bam Bigelow, and that isn't an insult. I think that's pretty awesome. Who's Bam Bam Bigelow? He's a wrestler, man. Second time someone said that about you. Oh, I do know who that is. You know why? Huh, why? Because someone's made that comparison before in my, like, five or six years ago. Wow. See, this is obnoxious. The Palancron combo is super obnoxious. But yeah, I can see that. This just takes forever. Come on, bro. We also we also need one more artifact because this is only fifteen damage. If we had one more artifact in play, yeah, it would have been lethal. I wonder if we I don't know if we could hit anything with Emery. What is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I don't think there's any artifact that we can specifically hit. Also, Golden Goose is like retired as champion in the poker group. He played once, won, and then left. He's like, I'm good, man. Thanks, guys. Well, I'm done. No, we don't have Greaves in the deck, right? Um, you can check the sideboard, I guess. I'm pretty sure we do. No, it's in the sideboard. Yeah, that's what I thought. Not jerking around. I have Emrakul Ulmog in hand. Oh boy, that's pretty wild. High tide Palancron Emrakul Ulmog with six islands. That is a thing. What if he is jerking around and it's like the 13 mana Emrakul? It's like the shitty one. I mean, that was still pretty good, but... I want to play. I've been dealing with a lot of anxiety attacks lately and other medical problems. Oh, no worries, man. 
I was just curious. Golden Goose, I hope you feel better, buddy. Same. Yeah, we take a screenshot of the deck. Oh, Walking Ballista from the graveyard would have been sick, actually. Yeah, if they had brain freeze, they would have done it by now. No, they. I don't think they. I think they. I think they're being honest, but I just want. I just want to see it. Okay. Well, no, because like I'm. Gonna, I'm gonna actually make them show me the win. Like if you have Splinter Twin and Kiki Jiki or Splinter Twin and like Pestermite, I see it. I see the win. Right. I'm not gonna make you go through it, but like, if you're just telling me you have cards in your hand, like I'm just gonna have to see it. Like that's just the bottom line. I actually don't know why Palancron is in the cube. It's kind of stupid. And and when you're on the Magic Online cube, like. The only benefit to the card is comboing like this, which is utterly tedious. Also, if he's Emrakul, why isn't he just Emrakul? He's just going to win the game. He doesn't need to do anything else. Yeah, I feel like you could just Emrakul here and take the turn and then go to the next turn. And if you want to... I guess because you have to make the infinite mana, you can't afford Ulamog next turn. Oh, sure. Yep, there's one. And... Yep, that'll do. That's cool. All right. Well, it's <sighs> annoying. Are they going fast? <laughs> think about that car. Yeah. Dang. You Might have been a motorbike. Yeah, I'm just gonna submit like this. I think our deck is fine. Board in smoke stacks and never stop uptaking it. Wow. We will all lose forever. Oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> yeah! This is it. I mean, I wish the Blight still was in our deck, but... Dude, I'm still getting Inkwell Leviathan on turn one. What if he doesn't play any islands? Then he has to play a creature every single turn? What if it's... Shut up! It's gonna win the game! What if it's got Death Touch? He's playing a Death Touch creature in his Mono Island deck? Yep. I don't think so, man. Do you play any games with your own? No. You didn't make it your own deck. They get three turns. Better make them good. Well, this is one. Alright. 13. Two turns. No, Kurt, I know his iron lock. I was just thinking of a made up scenario where they play like Swamp, Death Touch Rat. Yeah, he just. <laughs> Death Touch Rat. I, I don't see that. That does actual nothing. I mean, like, they could go, like, probe. I can't imagine, like, the four spells you play in with three mana. It's now or never. It's instant or sorcery, right? Yeah, it's got to be instant yeah. sorceries. Can't be planeswalkers. Can't be artifacts. That's one. That's a decent start. Probe could be two. Mm -hmm. Dude, you gotta you gotta be real lucky. <clears throat> All right, G -g probe gush. Wow, that would be insane. I mean, that's the only thing I can think of. I would lose my mind if they probed gushed. Here we go. Or maybe they're gonna daze their own spell. Is this real? I'm like, do they have another one mana spell? Didn't get it. Good game. Wow. Good games. <sighs> Jesus. I guess he had outs. <sighs> oh, hi. So yeah. I well, they, he already brainstormed. Like he knew what the top two cards were, right? Yes. Wow. Whew. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on twitch.tv slash Magic to get manatraders.com. Cool stuff, Inc. And uh, check out Freshly Brewed, the podcast today with Rob. You can find it anywhere podcasts are found. And I will see you guys next time.